Hello guys, Emmanuel from Geekception here and today I will be doing an unboxing of the new Inspiron 13 7000 series. Now what makes this different, I mean the only reason I'm doing this unboxing and maybe quick review I guess is because this comes with the 5th gen Core i5 processor and a full HD display. Now rather than talk 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 I'm going to cue the intro now and let's begin. <laughs> Welcome back guys and let the unboxing begin and the first thing I noticed about the box is that it's very very light and very very small uh, compared to like when I got my uh, MSI GS70 Stealth Pro so let's begin the unboxing just gonna cut this first uh, so, uh, and uh, it's quite a small box actually uh, let me take that to the side uh, it comes with this uh, comes with some manuals I guess uh, a quick start guide uh, let's put that to the side don't really care about that Ooh, and the first thing I noticed is quite small actually very very uh, small I guess so put that to the side uh, okay so uh, it's got two compartments inside uh, one is a power connector and the other is a power brick and that's all I guess whoa I don't need that. So the first thing I notice is, uh, like I said, it's quite small, the laptop itself. Uh, let's go into removing it now from this Protestic Nylon. Thumbs up if you checked your Facebook just now. Uh, okay, so let's remove this. Uh, see there. And it's quite light, I guess. It's very, very light. Uh, it's got this aluminum uh, casing. It's got this soft touch back. Uh, it reminds me of the Alienware series, uh, how it feels. And um, of course, it's a com uh, convertible laptop. So you can actually like, you know, go into touch mode here. Uh, you can go into presentation mode like this. Then you can go into laptop mode like this. And of course, when you go into uh, touch mode the keyboard becomes deactivated so this is quite a nice laptop actually uh, I was psyched to see it I didn't actually think uh, core i5 uh, fifth gen is you know would be out yet but uh, well here you go I'm going to just quickly do like a small product tour uh, so on the left side of the laptop you have a uh, power connector cable HDMI out uh, USB 3.0 two USB 3.0 and one audio jack along with a speaker here I believe uh, have you gotten the focus on the right side here, there's a SD card slot, and there's a US and USB 3.0 port, and that's about it for the left side. Uh, on this side, there's a power uh, on button. There's a power on button here, and there is a volume up, volume up and volume down buttons right about here. And um, if you look to this place, there's this thing here that stubbles out. Well, that's because this convertible laptop also has a pen. So if you click that, it comes with a pen also which I find is pretty cool because um, the person I got this for actually is going to use it for school and stuff. So it actually makes sense to have this with a uh, note or uh, one note, I guess, from Microsoft and maybe any third party uh, apps there. You can use it, you know, you draw on leash your creativity, I guess. And that's about it for the product tour. It's really, really light. As you can see, I can carry one hand. I think I can carry it two fingers I guess if this is the two finger test anyways yeah it's really really light guys and I think I'm going to like this even the back it looks really good on the back um, very very solid it does not feel flimsy at all we got this for about uh, 800 900 dollars if we convert it uh, about 2900 Malaysian ringgit so it's quite a very very good laptop the build quality is quite nice uh, thumbs up and uh, leave a comment guys if you want to see maybe benchmarks or because it has no graphics card but for those people interested if you want a test or you want something you can kind of leave it in the comment below and I'll think about doing that video if there are enough comments for that but that's about it this has been the unboxing and first look at the Inspiron Dell Inspiron 13 7000 series with the new fifth gen processor and a core uh, uh, i5 uh, processor so um, also I forgot to mention the display is full HD um, after this, I, I guess I'm going to show the video of it booting up and stuff. Well, 
But that's about it for this video, guys. Give this video a like if you like it. Give it a dislike if you dislike it. And please do leave a comment if as to why you dislike the video. And don't forget to be awesome. And do subscribe. That would actually quite help me. You know, it supports me. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye.